Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Today I am going to discuss FACO with Lucidus intraocular lens implantation using Contamac Argo Touch injector. It is a relatively soft cataract. And we proceed with frequency and at 12 o'clock position because this is a steeper meridian in this case and the patient carries about one diopter of astigmatism steeper axis being 90 degrees the anterior chamber is filled with viscoelastic material and at least a little viscoelastic is spread over the corneal surface then the two side port in cns are fashioned on both sides of the FACO and CN. Because my preference is bimanual irrigation aspiration, that's why I prefer two in CNs. The 27 gauge cystitome needle enters from the sideboard in CN. The capsulotomy is being completed. Tongue of the capsule is averted and then all the rest of the pull push force is applied on inverted anterior capsule. A very beautiful round rexis is completed. Hydro dissection comes into the picture, which is performed in incremental multi-quadrantic fashion little by little in each quadrant which is followed by hydro delineation and there is yellow ring sign generally i prefer the temporal approach for both eyes but in this case i placed my incn at 12 o'clock position the phaco hand piece comes into the picture little groove is prepared in the center tunnel and then i try to crack the nucleus and realize that it is probably being soft to cataract not possible so i modify the technique and keep on creating a central crater till the nucleus becomes disengaged and inverted at one end and easily emulsified after emulsification of the nucleus perinucleus is being taken care of and once this perinucleus is softly emulsified i replace the chopper with a fine polished spatula and complete the emulsification and then bimanual irrigation aspiration and polishing of the capsule is performed the interior chamber is filled with with viscoelastic material and here comes the edof iul with extended depth of focus a beautiful lens in our experience which combines the quality with the economy and gives quite good spectacle independence to most of the patients with its extended depth of focus feature. The lens is supplied in blister pack recently along with Contamac Argo Touch injector. Presently being in era of preloaded IULs, this appears to be a little cumbersome to me the assistant has handed over the cartridge and now the blister pack is open and the lens is being handed over to me with the help of mcpherson's forceps i place the lens inside the cartridge under microscope and pressing it into the 
cartridge tunnel with McPherson forceps. We gently close the cartridge so that there is no haptic or optic catch. Then the cartridge is parked in the plunger. And interestingly, this beautifully designed injector lacks one interesting feature that is locking of the cartridge. <clears throat> Once the assembly is com complete, the plunger is moved in forward direction so that the lens is placed in the pre-delivery position. Now it's ready. I have used 3.2 millimeter in CN here. It just snugly goes into the eye and a very slow injection process is my priority. And I keep on watching the delivery of the lens till the last minute. As the haptic is opening up, I'm very slow in the process because this lens beautifully centers because of its atypical wider haptic design, but you need to be careful while injecting it so that you don't entangle the margin of the anterior capsule into the leading haptic. And my priority generally is to implant the trailing haptic into the bag with the help of injector by dipping its tip. But in this case, it was delivered anterior to the capsule. Thus, I used Sinsky hook to position the lens in three and nine o'clock positions. And again, by manual irrigation aspiration comes into the picture for fine polishing and removal of the viscoelastic material from anterior chamber, as well as it goes behind the lens to clear the viscoelastic from its posterior surface. And finally, as in all the cases, little hydro infusion of the corneal stroma to close the self-sealing in CNs. The chamber is deepened and my tendency is to leave the eye tense at the end of the procedure. It's beautifully centered IUL. So this was Lucidus intraocular lens implantation with Contamac ErgoTouch injector. Thank you very much for your attention.